Man, this trail started off easy. Now it's like straight up the side of the volcano. You can really see the blast area. All right, we're at the base of the cinder cone. It's pretty sweet. Following you. Yeah. Tons and tons of lava everywhere. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today Lindsay and I are out on our kind of last big adventure day of our six week trip to Leeds in the St. George area. Today we are hiking kind of areas just north of Snow Canyon State Park. Right now we are on the Cinder Cone Trail hike and this is going to take us up through some uh, up to the top of a dormant volcano. All these kind of jagged dark rocks everywhere. This is all lava from a, a dormant volcano that erupted, I don't know, hundreds of thousands or millions of years ago. We're excited to be up there because once we get up to the top, we'll get to kind of look down into the volcano a little bit. Yeah, Lindsay and I have been super fortunate with the weather on this trip. It's been warmer than expected. So, you know, the days have been in the mid, mid to upper 80s for most of the trip. And it's finally starting to turn to feel a little more like winter. Uh, back near Salt Lake City where we live, um, it's actually snowing and there's been quite a bit of snow, a significant amount of snow, especially up in the mountains. So it's going to be a little bit of a shock when we go back and realize that it actually is winter up there. But man, the weather's been beautiful down here on this trip and it's really opened up the opportunity to get out and do a lot of things that we weren't sure that we'd be able to do or not, and especially with all the water activities. Fall is a great time because it's not too hot. We read that there were a couple gates that you have to pass through, and we just got to the first one. Do we go through this one? I don't know. They've made a secondary trail over time so that you don't have to access the private property. We're going up and going up there to the top of this volcano. This is something that Lindsay and I didn't really know about this area, but St. George is full of dormant volcanoes. There's lava fields everywhere. And it's kind of cool if you're not expecting it. Like. And I guess even if you are, if you haven't seen it, it's definitely something different. And you know, all of these black rocks and huge pieces of, of, of volcanic lava and little tiny you know, pebbles, kind of like this stuff. A little bit of everything. It's pretty neat. Yeah, this is beautiful already. Sun might create a little bit of a glare here, but wow, like, it's awesome. Our plan today is to do this cinder cone hike. So we drove from Leeds to St. George, up around Snow Canyon, and we're doing the cinder cone hike right now. And then after this, we're gonna go out to the Vortex, or also known as the Bowl, which should be a pretty unique sandstone feature. And then from there, the highlight of the trip for the day, Veo Pies. Oh man, I can tell I haven't hiked in a while. Yeah. This is hurting me. I just got back from a week long trip to New York City. This trail definitely has good signage. It's the second cinder cone sign that we've seen since the trailhead. And this trail's only like a mile and a half long. So it's pretty short, but I think we're going up there. So that's pretty steep for a mile and a half. Definitely got some elevation gain. It's like walking on marbles. Man, this trail started off easy. Now it's like straight up the side of the volcano. Yeah, the all trails comments and stuff said, be prepared for a steep climb. They weren't kidding. It's too much good food in New York and not enough exercise. And yeah, knee's actually doing pretty good. Man, what a view already. This is spectacular. It's hard work getting up here, but totally worth it. Got views for days. Yeah, a little cactus in the lava. Oh, got some steepness coming up. <laughs> Looks like this is the pretty big push up to the top. I think we're getting there. This might be the top. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah, you the can. Goes all the way around it. You can really see the blast area. So there's a trail that runs all the way around the rim of the crater. 
And then you can see the big impression where the volcano erupted and kind of destroyed itself. Man, look at the views. This is amazing. You got Snow Canyon State Park out in front of us. All these white sandstone rocks. Oh, there's the other cinder cone, straight ahead. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's pretty cool looking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that climb up was a little steep, a little slippery. You should walk ahead of me and I'll get your picture down in there. Okay. I never ever thought in a million years I'd be walking in the rim of a volcano. This is pretty sweet. Now this is a serious chunk of lava. This is super cool, all jagged and rough. It's got all bright colored lichen and all, all kinds of stuff all over it. Got some bright yellow and orange, kind of cyan. All kinds of different colors. This is super cool. That is a big chunk of lava. So we've made our way about halfway around the cinder cone and I think we're going to try to head down to the bottom and check it out from kind of the bottom perspective. We're heading down there. Yeah, steep and loose. What do they call these little pebbles? Like moky marbles. <laughs> little marbles that'll trip you up and make you slide. And there's lots of them here. This is cool. Yeah. All right, we're at the base of the cinder cone. It's pretty sweet. Got a little like fire pit and ring and stuff so you don't go climbing up out of here. This is super cool. Got a couple people up on the rim. I'm glad we came down here. Man, you get a perspective for how big this thing is. Yeah. It's huge. This is steep coming out of here. It's easier than I thought it would be. That was easy. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Going down was much harder. Yeah, I think it was more free than I needed to. This is slick. Yeah. There's someone called the Dustin. Alright, so the cinder cone hike, friggin' amazing. Like, short and sweet and straight to the point. And the payoff is awesome. The views down in Snow Canyon, the actual volcano itself, the fact that you can go down into it, which I didn't quite realize you could do. It's awesome. Awesome in my book. Highly recommend this. And like, there's nobody here, which is even better. So you get to kind of have the place yourself. Man, like just taking a little time at the top and enjoying the views. Super sweet. A plus in my book.